What's up guys, Brandon Jay. Today we're gonna be magnet fishing around 2,500 of these massive alligators. Oh gosh, out here in Gatorland, Florida. <laughs> All right, buddy, I gotta go, I gotta go. <laughs> you can give it to him. Oh my gosh. Come on, big fella. Oh. <laughs> Today we're gonna be dealing with monsters just like craftsmen here and a ton of other gators looking for items that tourists have lost while here visiting these beautiful gators. Me and my good friend Hudson here, we have these giant powerful magnets. These things literally hold thousands of pounds. But there's one problem, we literally have to avoid dinosaurs. Yeah. Monstrous <laughs> alligators with these giant magnets. There's also another small problem. Uh, these magnets, they're actually not mine, they're Tristan's. <laughs> so I don't actually own magnets. Tristan left these in my truck. He still hasn't gotten them out. <laughs> And uh, now we're gonna be putting them at risk of getting lost and getting Find chomped keepers, up man. by gators. Yeah, I mean, that's the world of no treasure problem. hunting. But Tristan, thanks for the magnets, buddy. Hopefully you get both of them back. We may have just lost Tristan's magnet in an alligator pit. So big thanks to Savannah for inviting us out here. She is basically gonna be spitting all the facts and making sure we keep both of our hands while throwing the magnet and see what we can find today. So my name's Savannah and I'm actually the enrichment coordinator for the animals here at Gatorland. So enrichment is basically what I do is think of exciting things for alligators and crocodiles to do to keep their minds stimulated and their bodies strong and sort of mimic natural behaviors. So taking these magnets and doing some magnet fishing and treasure hunting will be exciting for them because they don't know what a magnet is. They're gonna hear splashes in the water. They're gonna get excited about that. They'll wanna come investigate. Basically the magnets are gonna attract not only the treasure, but the alligators closest <laughs> to us today. So Gatorland is pretty much giving us free range on anything we wanna do today as far as treasure hunting, even close encounters with the beast of the water here, which I'm a little concerned about, but our main objective is to find stuff people lose here. As you guys could see, there's tons of people, thousands a day that come and visit all of these alligators and see all the other animals they have as well. However, if people are taking photos and maybe throwing some bait, they may lose a ring, they may lose a necklace, they may lose their iPhone. And that's where we come into play with the magnets. It's a super cool opportunity because like no one gets to do this. So anything that's been lost in like the past 73 years of this place being open is still at the bottom of these pits. There's quite literally no telling what we're gonna find. And well, I've never had to magnet fish around alligators before, but we'll deal with that when we get to it. Spot number one, we are actually jumping the gate to get to. Just feel like there's gates here for a reason. We're just crossing. All right, brother, it's just a magnet. Don't you worry. Just a magnet, brother. Don't come towards my magnet. Whatever happens, don't let this crocodile get it. That's the biggest crocodile. Oh, gosh, there is a huge crocodile. Okay. Hey, Hudson, she said, whatever happens, do not let that crocodile get your stuff. Yeah, the big angry crocodile, don't, uh, that's sketchy. That's actually very sketchy. He's coming too. Look, look, we got a whole audience of people here watching. And there's a giant crocodile just staring at me like 20 feet that way. Hey, big guy. I'm not trying to scare you. I just found a big screw over here. All right. I knew that was coming. Okay. That's Big Larry right there. Big Larry. He's diving down, finding my iPhone. Larry, get away from my iPhone, brother. All right. Gosh, big Larry, you're scary. All right. Nothing there for you, buddy. Sorry. Oh God, there's a massive alligator head right here. Oh God, oh God. Uh, oh, you FaceTime, are they still on? Here, let me say hey real quick. <laughs> They're on FaceTime. He's like nine Hi. Hi. Thanks for watching the videos. <laughs> What's your name? Aiden. Aiden. We got to bring you out here, man. I need some help tossing a magnet. I'm exhausted out here. The only thing I caught is a sunburn so far. But thanks for watching the videos, buddy. Thank we'll see ya. Bye, Aiden. All right. Bye, guys. An alligator coming for my rope. Why does this not surprise me? There must be something good right here. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. 
Oh no. We may have just lost Tristan's magnet in an alligator pit because, well, come here, Travis. One, there's an alligator right here. Um, very attracted to the magnet as well. But also, I think we may have hit some infrastructure. Oh, I got it, I got it, I got it. Yes, yes. Ah, oh, thank God. Dude, the magnet got stuck on something in there. I was like, oh, these are, these are my best friend's magnets. They're not even mine. <laughs> oh man, this is gonna be the best thing we found all day is this magnet, man. Forget the iPhones, dude. This thing costs probably more. I don't know, that's how expensive they are. Tristan bought one and I refuse to. That's how expensive these super magnets are. Wow. Okay, feel much better. I'm leaving this spot alone. So, this GoPro is hopefully stuff like we're gonna find today, but this one actually fell into a crocodile enclosure. It did. And so, it got bit. Yeah, so this is this is an investigation bite. This is, uh, I wonder what this is. Oh, sweet. Because it could have crushed the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But clearly. Just a little nibble. Yeah, it wasn't interested. <laughs> I get that. So uh, maybe we'll find some iPhones while we're out there magnet fishing with investigation bites on them. Yeah, remember I texted you, I was like, yeah. hey! I know, she's like- come with the magnet? <laughs> Hudson's going in, but I'm actually not allowed in because I'm wearing black and this bird is triggered um, by like black hats and black shirts because somebody in a black hat came and messed with it one day. So, Hudson's wearing a very close to black hat, but he should be fine. Right. Oh, he's right there. Oh, he's, he's right coming there. for your shoes. Ah. I'm not going to kick him or nothing. Come on, buddy. Ouch. Hang on. He's coming for his shoes. <laughs> oh wow! Oh, that's sketchy. <laughs> I have black Down on my face. Hatch. I don't like this. <laughs> that bird really wants Hudson for real. Yes, sir, <laughs> be nice. Oh. Wow! Oh, he's got a black. Don't open the door. He just jumped Hudson right now. He really needs not pass the vibe check. Dude, honestly, as soon as you try to walk out when he flew in there and you're like, he's on me, I was like, oh. Because <laughs> dude, when you're in there, we can't see, we can yeah. only hear. Casually a massive crocodile right here. I already see the water kind of rippling behind us here. Yeah. This is crazy. And I follow Savannah on Instagram and she'll call him by name. She'll be like, hey. Come here like Zeus, and Zeus will pull up. She'll be like, Henry in the back, come on, Henry. Henry like waddles it. It's crazy, it's really crazy. You want me to call him up? Yeah, let's call him All up. All right. <laughs> up here. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, come on, Gators. They're just cruising in here. Come on, Gators. Where, are you hungry? <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> There's one right there. On, yeah, you get him, Savannah. You tempt those hungry alligators. Crabfish, Buster, Lamar! <laughs> Lamar, get over here! Up here. <laughs> oh. 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 All right, this is now where it's I... gonna be your turn. It, my turn? As soon as they get up here. I felt like my turn. turn was in there far away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Maverick, come on. Come on, Maverick. All right, chill, Zeus. All right, Zeus. <laughs> okay, Zeus. <laughs> Oh, they're a big guy. I'm just making up names. Let's go, come on. Come on. Come on, all the way up, all the way up. Yeah, come on. Come on, big boy. Come on, big boy. Oh, oh. oh Lemmy. So fast. Lemmy, you're so fast. So fast. You're so quick, Lemmy. Let's go, let's go. I really want to look at the camera, but I feel like my, my I can't. All right, Brutus, have you seen iPhones get dropped? Any iPhones today? Uh, yeah, no, they're, they're keeping it locked down, man. They got a whole Apple store underwater over there. All right, for the people. Oh, gosh. Let's go, let's uh, go! That Sir Bites a lot. Sir Bites a lot. Cool. Stay away from Come here. On. Got it. I'm going to hang out on the left Come side. On. <laughs> <laughs> Alligator parkour right now. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, that's crazy, bro. Dude, the pop on that, he pop locked and dropped it immediately. 
Like Grafton, I know you want the camera I spotlight. The okay. Back pedaling me like this. I like the lay down. See how his actually. head's shaped like the craftsman shovel? That's oh, why yeah. he's a craftsman. Yeah. And he talks pretty good. He makes a lot of noise. He say hey. He say hey to our friends. Wow, I can't tell if I'm sweating because it's brutally hot outside or like I'm just like a little I stressed think it's out. Because there are dinosaurs on the ground right that here. That is also a great point. Yeah. Oh. Oh god! Oh wow! That was that was a lot. All right, I'm not gonna yell at you. Good We're job. good. I had a great time. We got the footage. <laughs> I'm gonna step this way. Thank you so much for participating. Let's get on the road. Wow, Craftsman, great job. <laughs> They're doing an alligator show over there. It's actually really funny, but I'll make a deal. Hudson doesn't know about this deal yet, but if this video gets 30,000 likes, 3-0, Hudson will do the show on the next time. So if you want 30,000 likes, we'll make Hudson do one of these shows so they have to make the alligator jump. Deal? 30,000? 30, 30, shake it. Shake it. 31,000. 31,000. All right, 31,000 likes. Hudson will be one of the instructors at the next alligator show. All right. Here comes the gators. Some or something. Uh, no, just finding stuff people lose. Oh, wow. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Well, this is an interesting predicament. Oh, boy. I'm gonna be honest, man. I don't work here. <laughs> you might have to ask him. I'm just finding stuff people lose, man. That is money. I am loving that. Oh, that's fire, too. We gotta get those, dude. We were struggling, so we went to the gift shop to become one with the gator. We got pimped out with the gator teeth, so the gators know, like, who's the boss around town. Okay, they're all trying to hide these iPhones. They keep swimming up, guarding them. I've got the hat. I don't know, I just, I really wanted the hat. Why are you standing like that? You know, uh, oh everybody's heard of Crocodile Dundee, right? Oh, uh, I'm Crocodile Cro Dundon. <laughs> <My, laughs> crocodile cro Dummy. Dummy, oh, okay. Crocodile go. Dummy is me. Yeah. I'll be that. I'm ready now, brother. Good. Oh, yeah. oh, that <laughs> hey, look, I'm in the spirit now, dude. Go. I've got the spirit of the alligator, right dude. Go. Right now, we're actually at the Jumperoo stage. This is where tons of people gather around and the alligators actually jump and catch chicken here. So we're on the stage right now. A lot of people gather around. I have a magnet. I'm gonna be tossing it in the show area. And then Hudson's actually on the outside of the show area. And he's gonna be where all the spectators are. We're both dropping magnets. And we both have to watch out for alligators. But how cool is this, man? Only people that do the show actually get to come out here. And here we are with magnets. And hopefully the alligators don't think it's chicken for some reason. Gator bit my magnet. Oh, look at that. Sure? <laughs> no, he let go. I was like, dude, I got something big. It was just, a, it was just an alligator. Y'all coming in hot. Big boy. Big boy's coming on in. Just, it's just a gator chilling. I think the alligators also think I work here now. Do they expect me to feed them? I mean, it looks like you're working. <laughs> Yeah. You got the necklace, you got the hat. You know, I had to, I will say. And you look like Danny does when he's off <laughs> with the shirt. We got alligator parkour happening behind us. We got a couple nails. We've got a, an audience here. Hudson just said he found something really good. He wouldn't tell us what it is yet, but it's got to be a banger. So far, it's just been nails today. No way. What do you think it is? 
Dude, I don't know. Is it on the magnet right now? On the magnet. There's a lot of things on the magnet. Really? Actually. One, two, three, four, five things on really? the magnet. Really? I don't know. Flip it. Flip it. We got a ring, baby. First one. Oh. Little alligator ring. Oh! Look at, look at that. Little alligator look. ring, dude. Dude, no way. We got that. And we got some nails staples and, and staples. Look and at nails. that. Forget, the, forget the nails. Look at that. A you little see? alligator ring. So dude, you, you thought going in there was the strat. Dude, that's first drop right here, baby. It's a legendary. I'm telling you, it's the power of the hat. I told you the gator's been holding down all the good stuff. As soon as I put this outfit on, we started finding bangers. So they're starting to relinquish the treasure. That was the yeah, problem the whole time. All right, oh, hey, no, <laughs> you keep dropping that magnet, dude. It, baby. Hold on to that ring. That's the best find so far. We're going to go back to the stage, toss the magnet around, but dude, that's absolutely epic. I found something. Look. No way. It's one, one of the, the old hooks. It's one of the cables we use for the show. We just dropped it the other day, so I knew I knew oh. where it was at, so it's kind of cheating. <laughs> I was about to say, man. I was like, dude, I quit, man. I've been busting my butt all day. I just had it. it was easier to use your magnet than going and get it. <laughs> oh, gosh, look at this. Got a gator next to the magnet. There you go. Oh, wow, look at all this stuff. Look at that. Oh, what do we got? We got a magnetic shell somehow. Big screw. Some weird things. Oh, I thought we had a ring, but it's just a keychain thing again. Uh, we'll get a dang ring. Hudson's not going to beat us like that. Every time these behind the scenes fences get open, I get a little more nervous. <laughs> oh, that's a giant alligator. <laughs> that's a big one. I'm, I'm protecting you. Thank you. Welcome. Okay. Not like I could do anything anyways, but. Oh, there's a crocodile on this oh, side. Oh, shoot. I forgot about that. We are going to have to scratch that. So she laid eggs right there. That's not only a crocodile, that's a crocodile nest. Delilah! <laughs> I forgot about that. Uh, Sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna hang out by the fence. <laughs> it's so crazy you see a giant alligator, it's sketch, and you see a crocodile, yeah. way more sketch. Yeah, so that's a Mama Nile crocodile. She would come after us for sure. We're yeah. not getting by her. She's uh, on eggs right now? Yeah, so she built a nest. Yeah. Uh, like they dig like a cavity and then yeah. put the eggs in there. So that's that's her spot right okay, now. Okay, cool. I am gonna go back on this side of the fence. I will see you over there. It's brutally hot outside. So we came into the office. There's like people on the phone and stuff behind us, but we wanted to show you everything we found. This is my side. Best find probably has to be this giant bolt. <laughs> and then I've got these uh, little fake rings. I thought these were rings right here, but they're just like those are like keychain keychain things. things. Yeah. yeah, and this is Hudson side right here. We got a bunch of nails, some kind of metal, some staples, some actual like new roofing screws, and then I think my best find of the day is a five cent euro piece and this little alligator ring, which unfortunately broke in the bag. It's just this little alligator mood ring, but uh. Definitely crushed it on the banger finds today, buddy. Look. For the general admission, yeah, absolutely. Tell you what, if we come out here and treasure hunt again and get this, we'll be able to build our own amusement park, bro. 100%. We really will. 100%. We really will. <laughs> All right, well, we just wanted to show you guys the finds, but now we gotta go back out in the heat. All right, guys, well, I think that is gonna wrap it up for today's video. We had an absolute blast. I will tell you one thing. These alligators and crocodiles will not get tetanus after me and Hudson tossed the magnet all day. We got a bunch of screws. We got a bunch of different bolts and stuff from the actual dock. I guess the nets around the dock that you guys have seen work for all the people losing their iPhones. I really thought we were gonna find an iPhone, but sometimes it's about the adventure more than the treasure. Speaking of the things that you find, I beat you. I have the banger find of okay. the day, okay. baby. Okay, first of all, first, <laughs> first of all, I busted my butt for hours, probably around five hours today. And by the way, a heat index of 108 degrees. We just yeah, heard that. Hot. Hudson took water breaks, he took food breaks, and he just happened to toss his magnet on a ring and got lucky. So he won the treasure day. Is it but luck or he, is it skill? He complained the most. He had the most food and hydration. He relaxed the most. I put in the work for you guys, and ultimately Hudson found the best find. Whatever. 
Yeah, I know. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> that croc is just peeking at us too. So from an enrichment side here at Gatorland, the alligators and crocodiles had an amazing day. We had one alligator named Oogie who followed us the entire length of this 15 acre lake. Everywhere we went, he was following us. He wasn't trying to eat anything. Um, all the alligators were super excited. It's always fun for them to have new things to see, new smells, new people all kinds of exciting things for them to uh, wrap their teeth around. <laughs> if you guys ever visit Florida and you're in the area, I would definitely suggest coming out to see this. It's unreal how big these alligators are. You get to feed them, you get to see them do acrobatic tricks in a way. It's so cool. So if you wanna come down and show support, tell them Brandon J sent you. But if you're far away and you wanna just consume more content like the videos you saw today, they actually have a YouTube and an Instagram channel. They are pumping content out on constantly. And what's even better than that, all of the money generated from those platforms actually go back into the conservation of these parks, which to me is so beautiful. They take care of these gators. They love these gators. They call them by name and the gators come up. You can be like, what's up, George? And George starts swimming to you. It's the strangest thing of all, but it just shows all of the love and time they put in with these animals and the fact that you guys can just consume their content and it helps pay for all their food and keeps the light on and helps take care of more gators that come in here is super impactful. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. The power of the gator necklace came in clutch it just made hudson lucky not me so i hope you guys enjoyed and as always we'll catch you on the next adventure peace out there's ever a time that i wanted a harness to be 100 percent this is this yeah. is probably this sure. this uh <laughs> well there's nothing 100 percent in life oh perfect <laughs> oh, oh god all right here we go A big alligator. So right now, Hudson and I are on the last zip line we're gonna do, but it's actually a race. So I'm gonna go against Hudson, and we've got a little wager. On your mark, get set, go. I'm in a ball, son. I'm in a ball. Ah. I'm gonna win. <laughs> no! Dude, it's so close. <laughs> who do you who do you think won? Oh, you got him that much. I got him. Oh, dude, you got to kiss a goat. <laughs> so you guys remember Hudson lost the zip line. I didn't lose. He lost. Brandon's just too scared to do he it. Lost. like everything else today. Our my zip line instructor, Megan, actually lifted my zip line to let me go faster. She indeed said that I win, so it's two versus one. Now Hudson has to kiss a goat. Hudson does have a nice little ice cream cone right here, though. So just draw them in with that, and then just give them a good old peck. Come up here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, on. look at that lip action. <laughs> Come on. Look at Come that. Come on. Look at that. Come here. Look at that action. There we go. Ready? Ready? Oh. Come on. <laughs> I'll give you some, baby. Come here. Come here. Oh. Oh, wow. Dude. All right, cool. Cool. Wow. Cheap day, huh? It's kind of disturbing that you picked a goat with such a long beard, but you're a man of your word. Let's continue to try to find some more treasure around these gators. The goats are cute, the gators have not so much, but let's go hang out with them now. <laughs>